Not all that can be counted matters, and not all that matters can be counted. I have this one specific student that started as a third grader in my classroom, and it took us years just to uh, memorize his letters and to master the sounds of the letters. And on his third and final year, one day it just clicked. It was just the proudest. And then he thanked me. He thanked me and said, thank you, Miss Eliza. You helped me through it. So fast forward two years later, right? He's in middle school now. And I, keep, I try to keep in contact with their families, with the parents. And then one day, I just got a text and said, Miss Eliza, congratulations on being Teacher of the Year. And I was like, who is this? And it's that student. And I said, how did you know? And he said, he read it on the announcement board outside the school. He saw my name. Teacher of the Year, Miss Sarmiento. And he said, that was my teacher. And I was like, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's like full circle. My third grader now could read signs, you know? And that's what, why we're here. We're teaching them to be a functional adult in the community. And I was just so surprised and at the same time, just even prouder that that student saw my name, <laughs> his teacher. And he actually told me texting. So not just reading, he is writing too.